Hello, this is Kirill from forexboat.com and welcome back to the course on Forex Trading. In today's tutorial, we will be talking about the triangle pattern. Now, the triangle pattern is a very powerful yet extremely simple formation on the Forex market and right now we're going to learn how to use it and make profits with it. So here we've got uh, a chart, a hypothetical chart that's um, kind of moving sideways and if we draw a line above and below the chart, we'll see right away that um, the price is in a triangle formation. Where can it go from here next? Well, it can continue going in the triangle and more often than not, that's exactly what happens. The price keeps progressing in the triangle. But then there's an issue. There's nowhere to go. The triangle ends. And that's exactly when this happens. The price shoots out. Now the shootout can go up or down, depends on the situation. Uh, the outcome can be different and often, very often unpredictable. However, the main core concept of the triangle is the fact that the price, the amplitude of the price movements is decreasing. So um, you can kind of witness a consolidation in the market. And it's not a coincidence. It means that there's something happening in the world or in the traders minds that is uh, forcing them to slow down their trading and is increasing the level of uncertainty for this particular currency pair and therefore the market consolidates and then bam all of a sudden something happens a movement picks up and it shoots out so more often than not it will happen exactly in this way so the triangle will progress towards very close to its uh, end and uh, then the market will exhibit an impulse and the price will shoot out up or down. And that's exactly what we will be taking advantage of. So the triangle is also a very um, good pattern because it actually gives you targets. So if you measure the base of the triangle and then you copy this measurement to the place where you think the price will shoot out, then a, an aggressive target is exactly the size of the base but it is always recommended to go with the more conservative target, which is more reliable, uh, half of the base. So if you measure half of the base from the point where you think the price will shoot out, that's where you should set your take profit. So let's look at the same situation, but when the price shoots out downwards, here you'd also measure your base, copy it over there and um, set your take profit at about half the distance of the base. So that's all good. But in reality, we don't know which way the price will shoot out. So what do we do? Do we buy or do we sell? Well, this is the beauty of trading a triangle. And that's why I love um, the triangle pattern so much. Is because the price amplitude is narrowing down and you know or you're forecasting that with a very high probability, there'll be an impulse. But you don't know which way. But on the Forex market, you can set stop orders. You can set pending orders. And that's exactly what you should do in this case. So instead of buying or selling and taking our chances with that, what we're going to do is we're going to set two pending orders, one buy stop order and one sell stop order. So whichever way the price goes, we're going to earn a profit. As long as there is an impulse, it doesn't matter whether it's upwards or downwards, we can earn a profit from that. And that is a massive advantage of technical analysis over fundamental. Because in situations like this, you don't have to predict where the price will go. You just have to predict that it will go somewhere. And so uh, we set these two orders. Uh, and the take profit of each of the orders is uh, set at about half the base of the triangle. So that's exactly how you trade the triangle. And moreover, further in this course, you will see a live example from a real account where I do exactly that. And the triangle does shoot out and we do earn a profit. It's just mind-blowing how well this strategy works. So to sum up with the triangle, uh, three main points. First of all, triangle means market consolidation. And it's one of those instruments of technical analysis that can actually picture the psychology of traders on the chart. So that is very powerful. So it combines technical analysis and sentiment analysis in one pattern. The second point is that the most likely exit out of a triangle is an impulse doesn't happen 100% of the time, but definitely happens more often than not. And the best part about this is you don't have to predict which way the market will go. All you have to do is set a buy stop and a sell stop order, and whichever way the market goes, you have a good chance of earning a profit. 
And finally, the triangle gives you a defined target, which is a very strong advantage of this pattern because it makes it straightforward and very easy to incorporate into your trading system.